Hey, Kirk Yonke here in the Fox 31 Denver studios. Hope your Tuesday's off to a good start. Who is she calling at 5 o'clock in the morning? Let's go. I just wanted to make sure you were okay. Okay, all right. Okay. Okay, good. Is mom okay? Mom is okay. My mom lives in Greenville, South Carolina, and they got hit with an ice storm last night. Oh. So I had to make sure mom was all right and that she had power. Okay, and she's good. <laughs> I, hey, check in on mom. Yeah. You got to appreciate somebody doing yeah. that. And it, it's seven till forty-two on yeah. the east coast, so yeah. it's a little bit later. How's it going? Good. What's happening? Not much. Went sledding yesterday. I'm a little jealous. Woo! My kids took me sledding. Didn't you love that? How like in the mid to latter part of the afternoon, about three, three thirty, it just got this big snowburst, and it was... oh, it was snowing like crazy oh. when we went. Sl- we went sledding at about three, three thirty. That's yeah. exactly when we went sledding, and it was snowing like crazy, and it was so much fun, and oh, it was just a blast. And now. What happens next? Well, we do have some single digits out there in spots. Uh, Castle Rock, Estes Park, Conifer, those areas. We're still in the 20s in Denver. We're going to warm up today, get above freezing just a little bit. Okay. Uh, I'm going to hold us in the 30s because of all that snow on the ground. We'll continue to warm up towards Thursday. And we have another system coming in Friday through Sunday morning. Just in time for the weekend. Yeah. And then it looks like we may get another system a week from Thursday. Do you think we'll see accumulation with this? Yeah, I do. Okay. All right. I kind do. Of Most round. of the snow will be Saturday, so I would make maybe some sledding plans or yeah. maybe some, you know, kind of planning. Well, I out. think those plans will be made for me. Well, and I know you made your, your wife made chili yesterday. Yes. Another chilly day coming okay. on Saturday. It was good chili, too. <laughs> a little brown sugar in there. Oh, sour cream, some cheese. She knows what she's doing. Do you have tortilla chips or cornbread? Uh, cornbread. Fresh made cornbread. Nice. That was good. I made the corn chowder. <laughs> Y'all should have brought samples. I'm wondering where are the samples. By the way, happy I, I Fat froze, Tuesday. I froze fat a big Tuesday. thing of it. Next time you get sick, I'll bring it to you. You froze it? Oh, I have to wait until I get Just sick. Just let it go, bro. <laughs> fat Tuesday! Woo! No. You said frozen. Today. Can't see. Let the good times roll. The baby Jesus is in the middle. You have to put the baby Jesus, you hide it yourself. I think they must have done that because of choking hazards. What do you think? Well, I don't know. Doesn't the baby Jesus melt if you bake it? They, they used to bake it in. Anybody they? out there from New Orleans know the little secret to cooking the baby Jesus in the king cake? I'm going to look it up. I don't know. Hope your Fat Tuesday is off to a good start. We've got uh, lots of stuff going on. Chris Jose is breaking down some a challenge to some immigration laws that were supposed to take effect tomorrow and what that means now, how that changes things and, and what's going to happen next with that. And, uh, of course, we're watching the situation out on the East Coast. Boston, a mess. They've got just crazy amounts of snow. And uh, we'll let you know how the commute shapes up. 5 to 9, Fox 31 Denver. Happy Tuesday.